Hello Aquarius, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel, Silavi Tarot here. Let's see what's going on with you guys at this time. What's going on with my beautiful Aquarius? Sending you guys love, of course. And if you guys are interested in a personal reading, my email is below. And follow me on Instagram if you get a chance. Okay, so we have patience here, guys. I was very patient, I'm hearing. I was very, very patient. I was patient. I've been patient, I'm hearing. I've been patient with you. New beginning here. Ghosted and no. Uh, and you are my light here at the bottom of the deck here. So I feel like... I get this shocking energy. I'm feeling like a lot of you guys are in this place where you are... Deciding to make a decision where someone here couldn't make a decision at some point here. Someone um, refused, was not able, unable to make a decision here. For a lot of you guys, there was a very strong new beginning here at some point. A very strong new beginning that brought a lot of joy and clarity, all right, in terms of your feelings, in terms of your emotions. But at the same time, there could have been an individual here that was ghosting their feelings, ghosting you, ghosting the truth in this connection, okay? And I feel like this person, you may or may not be speaking with this person, but I just feel like this person has not truly opened up, but yet still watching you, I feel. All right, someone here is still watching, someone here in the midst of turning their back. I'm still watching, right? I'm still wondering what this person is thinking. I'm wondering if there's still a chance in this connection with this person, right? So let's look deeper and see what's going on. Let's see what the vibe is like here. Let's get an energy for you guys, okay? So what's going on what's going on with my beautiful aquarius aquarius sun moon venus signs messages messages here thank you again you know i feel like again when you met this person there was a lot of joy you guys could share uh you know the same sort of interest in music same interest in, in humor and things of that nature i feel like someone here struggled with actually moving towards stability here okay they could have been dealing with somebody here that was very stuck in their ways this could be someone that is stuck in a situation or just stuck period right stuck in the past stuck physically just not able to really move here and i feel like it brought in a lot of disappointment for someone here okay because i feel like there was a lot of hope it was a lot of expectations and joy, right? Because I feel like there was a lot of love here. Okay, bottom of the deck over here staring at me. We have accidental love here. Someone here didn't think that they were going to feel this way. I didn't think I was going to feel this way when I met you, right? And I feel like you could have been dealing with someone here that didn't really speak on their feelings. All right, someone could have been dealing with two people. But I feel like someone here wasn't very open with their emotions, right? It was one of those things where it's like I, I could feel your love. I could feel it. But it's okay if you don't say anything, but I could feel it. But I feel like that became too much at some point. That became uh, too repetitive, where this person constantly kept you in the dark, right? Kept you thinking, all right? Again, you guys could be dealing with somebody that just overthinks here, all right? Truly overthinks, uh, not very sure of, you know how to communicate or just chooses not to communicate for a lot of you guys. But again, like I said, this was something that um, had a lot of potential for a lot of you guys, really. But I feel like something happened here where someone here felt alone, right? Where I had to really try to uh, deal with the situation alone, right? Where I feel like I'm not able to express myself to this person or I'm not really able to open up to this person or i have opened up but i don't feel like this person's doing anything about it here so we have the tower so some of you guys could have again found out the truth about something here or there was some sort of abrupt event that took place that really shattered this connection at some point here all right where it brought in this ghosting energy here where someone here decided to not work on this and just leave okay it could have been an argument or it could have been the truth that someone realized that someone's not going to work on it or someone's incapable of working on something i found out the truth okay i found out that our foundation was possibly rocky there was something that was off here someone possibly stepped into this connection here with um some sort of idea or 
some sort of like rugged past or an idea in terms of how they view uh, commitment or how they view stability here. And I feel like the truth just presented uh, itself at some point, right? Where you're not ready, all right? Or you're not able to be honest with what you want here, okay? Some of you guys could have lived with this person or you're just always at this person's home, okay? That's for some of you guys. All right, give me something for this ghosted energy. What's going on with that here? Give me something with this ghosted energy. Some of you guys also, another thing I'm getting here, if you have pictures or this person has pictures of you, I feel like this person looks at your pictures a lot here, okay? Thinks about you a lot or, you know, just, yeah, this person definitely possibly, I don't know how they could watch you, but I do see this person definitely staring at photos and things like that. There could have been some sort of argument that happened or some sort of back and forth or struggle that brought in this ghosted energy where someone decided to no longer work on this, no longer um, make a decision, all right, where this person possibly uh, had so many options or just had this confused energy. This was a very confused individual when it came time to actually perform and work on the relationship. How does this person feel about my Aquarius? <laughs> still attracted to you. Still attracted to you. Still thinks about you here. Okay, but very quiet energy. This could be somebody here that tried to come back Aquarius, but I feel like once they came back, they played games again, I'm hearing. All right, what is this person's intentions? Mm. All right, so this person was very serious here about you, all right? I feel like they were serious about you, but when it came down to actually moving forward with you and starting something new and fresh, I feel like this person was unable to do this. This person could have another female interfering in this connection or could have some sort of children here. This, okay, could have like some water sign still interfering in this connection or some sort here or someone's allowing other people to interfere with this connection. But I do see someone here still stuck in the past, right? For some of you guys, you truly wanted a family with this person, right? I wanted children. I wanted to have a new beginning with this person, but this person blocked it out, right? They refused my offer by their actions, right? By their energy, okay? What was the obstacle here? What was the obstacle for this connection, please? manipulation so this person could have been either there was someone else or this person could have been strongly in this energy of fear here fear to take a leap of faith into this beautiful new beginning all right couldn't make a decision i feel like when it came time to actually move forward here okay aries energy here too capricorn taurus or virgo but i do feel like someone here was unable to move forward right holding back stringing you along right playing this dance, this back and forth dance here, but still knowing that they have this connection with you, right? It's like, at some point, I feel like Aquarius, you started feeling like, you know, this was something that was very heavy on your vibration, very heavy on your spirit, where it's like, I'm ready for something amazing. I'm ready for my next chapter, but I feel like someone here was afraid or is afraid here. And that brought this energy of this person possibly declining or running or saying no. Okay, truly manipulating this energy. But again, like I said, I feel like it's just a lot of fear is what I'm seeing here. A lot of fear, a lot of back and forth. And someone decided to just say, all right, you know what? C'est la vie, okay? Um, I'm not going to be able to go back and forth um, with this here because I really feel like this was really taking a toll on you. We have, I hope I will see you again sometime here. Okay, so this is somebody again, I do feel like they think about you, all right? But Aquarius, I feel like you're at this, you're at your limit here with this energy. You, you definitely are. Okay. Cause I feel like one minute this person is, you know, they have a good poker face, Aquarius. All right. A very good poker face here. I do not feel like this person wants to let you go. Hence why they're constantly coming back and forth here. All right, but I do feel like this person has a bigger reason for why they constantly play these games. All right, there's a lot of fear here. Okay, this person could have some sort of addiction or this person could be very depressed for some of you guys. They could be going through a lot and they're possibly not expressing that to you. Very stressed energy. They could be in a very um, toxic home or toxic environment here or toxic job situation for a lot of you guys or they're trying to really move towards their career and it's a struggle. 
all right and we have i understand better now so yeah so i feel like for a lot of you guys at some point there will be this huge understanding that will come in via messages or you'll just get a message about this person here you're going to start really understanding why this person constantly said no why this person constantly refused your energy okay for some of you guys there may be some sort of conversation right where this person uh definitely comes through and says hey in that moment i just didn't care right i was going through a lot and i just didn't care i wasn't able to take that leap with you here okay also i'm also getting for some of you guys this person may be stuck in their past a relationship that failed something that didn't work out for them and i feel like they're dragging this into new chapters into their life here okay so i feel like that could have been one of the obstacles here as well give me one more please for my aquarius all right again in that moment i didn't care this person truly came off like I didn't I didn't care okay for some of you guys um, I don't feel like you're wanting to go back to this because of your uh, time that has been invested okay so some of you guys honestly may turn this person down all right that's just for some of you guys but a lot of you guys are turning this down because you don't want the games it's it's the games that's a problem right it's the back and forth it's the inconsistency you guys are just losing faith in this person's you know determination to actually want to be in a uh, serious relationship or a committed relationship here all right let's get the vibe check here for a lot of you guys someone here is really exhausted right i'm really tired of playing with this person like i'm really really tired you know i'm really tired of trying to figure this person out right this person could be very secretive this person could just have you running you know a marathon here right it's like i'm i'm running my endurance is is all out i can't all right give me the vibe here for this for my beautiful aquarius okay beautiful aquarius here could be dealing with somebody that's very jealous as well i'm getting all right for a lot of you guys thank you very jealous very jealous and some, I feel like for a lot of you guys, the way that this person speaks at time could be very, mm, yeah. All right, what's the vibe here? Wow. So this person really misses the connection here. And I feel like this is one of the reasons why this person may come back. I feel like this person really feels the connection, okay? A lot of you guys, this person really feels the connection. And I feel like this person has... Oh, and doubted this connection for a very long time i will say all right doubted this why because i couldn't make a decision in the past here right i knew the connection was there but i choose not i chose not to make a a, a decision here okay i chose not to make a decision some of you guys may be going back and forth in your mind if you should truly uh, send this person a message or if you should meet up with this person again right because the connection is so strong here but I feel like this is someone here, again, this is someone here that really wants to reconnect with you. They really do. Anywhere, they're saying, let's just meet up. Be very mindful that this person is not in this energy of still being guarded, you know. Because I feel like this person, it's like they want the connection, but they're not really willing to open up at times. And I feel like that's something that definitely needs to be addressed here. It's like I'm not, I don't feel like this person wants to let you go, okay? This could be you, Aquarius. But at the same time, this person's not being, you know, open, okay? It's like they're sending you messages, but they're still holding back. And the truth is, honestly, Aquarius, boundaries, yes. But at the same time, this person misses your energy. They miss the connection, right? They miss how much you really care about them, how, how sweet you are, how loving you are with this person. Thank you. And they wait right and they wait here and i feel like a lot of you guys may not reach out to this person right and it definitely puts someone in this energy of feeling abandoned or left out okay but i feel like someone here has been waiting for a very long time here and still waiting all right this could be your person but i do get an energy of waiting and someone feeling truly left out all right how's aquarius feeling about this person how's aquarius feeling at this time <clears throat> My Aquarius, please. Aquarius. Is Aquarius feeling? Mm, you guys want love? Yeah. So you guys just want fairness. You guys just want balance here. 
right? I just want balance. I just want fairness. Seriously. Like, I feel like there's just been so much confusion with this situation that had so much love here, right? Feeling like other people are involved, right? Feeling like there's always a uh, hit or miss with this person. It's like I could, you know, this person could, you know, come off like they have mood swings or one minute they're here, one minute they're not. So I feel like you guys are really stepping into this energy of balancing yourself out, right? Balancing out your boundaries what you're actually looking for in a connection okay some of you guys may definitely tell this person the next time they come around exactly um where you stand okay not where they stand but where you stand okay and i feel like that brings in a lot of clarity how is this person feeling about my aquarius at this time okay how's this person feeling about my aquarius currently aquarius sun moon venus signs Aquarius. Aquarius. Wow. Well, yeah. Be sure again, you know, I feel like this person is still in this energy of holding back Aquarius. Okay. I do feel like this person wants to come in and have some sort of reconciliation, but at the same time, you know, they're holding back. It's like, it's like one of those energies of, I want you, but I'm, I'm scared. I'm hesitating here. Okay, but definitely wanting that reconciliation, wanting to come towards you, right? Wanting to overcome their fears here, okay? But I feel like with the boundaries that you're setting up for yourself and setting up for your, you know, whole energy overall is going to show this person, you know, exactly what route to take with you, okay? You don't know about anybody else, but this is what I'm looking for, right? I feel like you guys are really just putting your foot down in terms of protecting your heart space, Okay, finding strength. Could Leo energy here? You guys are really finding a lot of strength to speak up for what you want. Move away from energies that don't mean anything positive to your soul. You understand? Moving away from over giving energy. Okay, those that are possibly trying to control or, you know, take advantage of things like that. You guys are definitely moving into this Empress energy, starting new, right? Letting people know at the gate. All right. I'll talk to you guys soon. Have an amazing one. I love you guys.